please read the question, pause the video, try to solve it yourself first. In a country X, cigarettes are forbidden. So people trade cigarettes in a black market. The cigarette demand is QD equals to 12 minus P, while cigarette supply is QS is equal to 2P. The government becomes aware of the black market and reinforces the police that half of the cigarette supply would be seized and destroyed. How does the consumer surplus is going to change between them? Okay, before intervention. Before government intervention. Why I write it here, I write every point. Huh? Solving in the paper, you do not, of course, have to write everything. But while you're making your notes, definitely you will have to write. Right. QD is equal to 12 minus P. So when P is 0, Q is 12. Q is 0, P is 12. So this is the demand function which I have. QS is equal to 2P. Beta, this you understand? This is Q is equal to P. So QS is equal to 2P. So if P is 1, Q is 2. P is 2, Q is 4. Something like this. So P is 1, Q is 2. P is 1, Q is 2. P is 2, Q is 4. Something like this, right? So this is going to be Q is equal to 2P. Right? Q is equal to 2P. Okay. So before government intervention, demand equals to supply. That is 12 minus P equals to 2P. 12 equals to 3P. P equals to 4. And you substitute this P equals to 4 in either demand or supply. So Q is equal to 12 minus, that is 8. So what do you have? This guy. Here. So price is 4, demand is 8. And what is the consumer surplus out here? I'm writing it consumer surplus one because this is before the intervention case, case one, you can say. So consumer surplus is this area, the area of this triangle. So what is that? One by two, 12 minus four into eight minus zero. That comes out to be 32, right? The government becomes aware of the black market and reinforces the police that half of the cigarette supply will be seized and destroyed. So after government intervention, right, after government intervention, after government government intervention, your supply function becomes just Q is equal to P. Just Q is equal to P, right? Uh, so you remember, I mean, how, how exactly we are getting this? So earlier, don't write this. I'm just explaining this point. So earlier you had Q is equal to 2P. Fair enough. Uh, now, Half of the Q is going to be destroyed. So this is new Q, right? This is new Q. So this is what my supply function is. Demand function is same only. Hmm? So I'll put demand equals to supply. P is equal to 6. And you can put P equals to 6 in either demand or supply. So it becomes what? 12 minus 6, which is 6. 12 minus 6, which is 6. Mm -hmm. 
so you have six quantity so after government intervention this thing becomes 12 minus 6 into 6 minus 0 but this becomes the consumer surplus now 1 by 2 into 12 minus 6 into 6 minus 0 right so this thing comes out to be uh, 18 this thing comes out to be 18 so what is the change in consumer surplus Earlier it was 32, now it is 14. So it is, sorry, now it is 18, so it is 14 now. Because this has decreased by the amount of... So this was about consumer surplus. I'll ask you something about producer surplus. So can you tell me how do you write producer surplus in the short run? How do you write what is an expression for the producer surplus in the short run? Please tell me that. Thank you, Vita.